For the Beaver Radio Network, I'm Brian Schultz. BSU men's basketball team knocked off Minnesota Crookston right before break. Joined by the reigning Beaver Pride Athlete of the Week and the NSIC North Division Player of the Week, William Harvey, a junior out of Albuquerque. Congratulations. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. You had your first career double-double. Uh, that and a 72-65 win over Crookston. 28 points, 13 rebounds. What led to that big night? Uh, I mean, I think I was excited for break and just wanted to play as hard as possible to have a good note going into it. So I think that's why, honestly. Only two of those rebounds were on the offensive end. So that's a pretty good night on both ends of the court. Yeah. Which do you take more pride in, offense or defense? Uh, of course I like playing offense more, but... I like I like defense. I like blocking shots, and steals, help side defense for my teammates. Your story is a unique one that in that you've played now for three teams in three years. Mm-hmm. A lot of times when you hear stories like that, it's not always a good story. Right. Why are you playing for your third team in three years? Well, I started off and I wasn't focused. And I didn't really know like I wanted if I want, should play basketball or not, and then. I ended up getting injured the next year and had to change teams. I had to quit to get surgery. And then I went to school close to home to just get stats and just get some highlights. And then here I am now. It worked out. I mean, it was never really a bad like circumstance at each school. It was just, just didn't work out each time. And now I finally found a home, it seems like. so. How does it feel to be home? feels good. It feels, you don't have to worry about, oh, where I'm going to be next year. Uh, <laughs> what am I going to do for a scholarship or whatnot? It's really nice. I like the coaches. I like the, the teachers. I like everything about this school. On the court, first half, uh, as, as far as the team is concerned, what were some of the bright points as far as you're concerned? Uh, first half of the season? Um, I mean, I feel like we have pretty good chemistry. I mean, me being a transfer, a junior, it's a little bit harder to learn the system and fit right in like with the seniors but I think we really started to pick it up and starting to gel together so I I'm hoping that'll carry over break and you know, just it wins what needs the most work here in the second half needs the most work I think we need to hit more shots and definitely just clamp down on team defense and just, if we clap down on team defense, we'll be in a good position every game to win. What's the biggest challenge in playing a team for the second time in a year? So they've seen everything you ran <laughs> <laughs> the first time. They know what you like to do. They know your tendencies. So, But the coaches are really good about uh, changing changing up the way we do things for each the second time we play a team. So we hit them with something new each time. Be, coming from junior college and NAI now to Division Two. how much more work does it take away from the court just in watching video and getting the game plan in uh, than what you've had in the past? Um, each level was a little bit step above. Chico was a little bit above NAI and um, NCAA D2 was definitely above that. But I would say if you're a player that really wants to get better, you're going to get in the gym and try to get better at each level. So I haven't really been in the gym too much more than I would have been with the others. But off the court, there's a lot more film sessions and more strategized weightlifting than at the previous schools. Being from New Mexico, did you get home where it's warm at all over break? <laughs> you know, I thought it was going to be warm, but then we ended up having a blizzard. <laughs> I couldn't even go anywhere Saturday night, my last night there, so roads were way too bad. It, I haven't seen it that bad in a long time in New Mexico. It's not supposed to get like that down there. Yeah. It's supposed to be like that here, and it hasn't skating. done that here. Yeah. <laughs> Best luck uh, this weekend of Minot, Mary. Appreciate it. Thank you, sir.